Hey guys, welcome to today's video. We're gonna be testing out an eyeliner. Thank God, because my face looks a little bit blank without lashes and liner, and I'm like a full glitter situation right now, so I'm gonna be applying on camera this right here. This is new from Maybelline. This is the Curvitude Liner Tracer. I have the shade 410 Black Noir, and this is said to help you put your liner on with ease. It is ergonomically correct to help you make your line just perfect and effortless. It has like this little bent guy at the bottom. So I'm gonna crack into here, check out what the fuss is. It has an ultra fine tip and it dries down matte, which I really like both of those things in a liquid liner. And I'm curious to see if this little bent bottom makes things easier or not. So I'm gonna zoom you in really close. We're gonna try it out. This retails for $8.99 and Let's just get to it. And then I'm gonna take you with me throughout my day and see if it is long wearing and, you know, if it's a good product on the face from morning to night as well. You guys, I've been sitting here struggling for a few minutes trying to get the wing sharp. And the issue is, you know, the design does make it glide right on. It's really nice, especially for that inner corner. The problem that I'm having is when you go back over the product, if it's dried, it will like bald spot and be weird. Kind of like if you put on a coat of nail polish too fast after the first coat and it kind of drags the product off. It's doing that a lot. And then I had to take a little wipe and kind of clean up the edges and it's very smudgy. So I'm having a hard time so far. I'm gonna try and match up the other eye and we will see if maybe that eye applies a little bit better. What's cool about this is on that inner corner, it is really nice. It goes nice and flat. So the lashes are on, which always makes such a dramatic difference in pulling the full look together. The liner was a little bit difficult, you guys, not because of how it's bent, but because of the actual formula. So I do like this handle. I do like the method of having it bent at the tip. You can really get in that inner corner so nicely. My issue is that this formula is just really hard once it dries. And when it dries, if you go back over it at all, you get bald patches. And then when you try to clean it up, it's the type of formula also that's not very forgiving. It's very smeary. I feel like I have little areas of discoloration even though I went over it with a beauty blender with a little bit of foundation on it. I'm just not 100% happy with my liner. Now Maybelline does make a gel liner that I absolutely love. So there are other options from Maybelline as far as liners go that I think are fantastic. I just really wish the formula in here was better, but nonetheless, we're gonna see how long it wears because I was able to make it look pretty good. It is $8.99, it's affordable. Let's see how long we can get wear time out of this and I will take you with me through my day, do a couple of check-ins and get the full scoop. All right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. The eyeliner looks really good still. It was just such a pain to put on. You don't even know the amount of time it took. I normally spend maybe 25% of the time that I took today doing my eyeliner, doing eyeliner. So that kind of makes me already not like the product if I'm just being honest, but my wings are looking good. Still very intense in color. Nothing is flaking, nothing is smudging. So I am happy with it at the moment. I'm just not happy that I lost half of my morning putting on winged eyeliner. Was it worth the extra 10 minutes? <laughs> no, it was not worth the extra 10 minutes. No, I want that part of my day back. I can't tell the difference. Of course you can't. Am I wearing drugstore lipstick or high end? Please tell me, expert. Let me tell see. Me. Drugstore. No, fail. It's neither. It's indie brand. I did a video on that. I will Wait, link it below. Hold on a second. You just gave me a loaded question. That's not fair. 
it is fair. You guys, it has been a couple of hours, not even a lot of hours actually, and I am sitting here needing to touch up my eyeliner because I am actually about to go and take a passport photo. I take my job very seriously, but not that seriously. So I need a Q-tip. I'm just, I'm cleaning up this mess. I am not gonna have a passport photo for years with like smeary black liner underneath my eyes. No. Normally I don't touch up anything when I'm doing a testing a new product video, but I just wanted to show you guys that the product is actually transferred down into my tear duct. I cannot stand it when ink liner does this. It's my number one thing that I don't like. I hate looking like there is black smeary stuff right here or if it smears or transfers. I'm always looking for something to really lock in tight where I don't have to worry about that issue. So. We are officially not liking the initial application and the time that it took and also the fact that it's smeared. So I'm gonna clean this up and then go and take my passport photo. And it's gonna be funny because I'm gonna look at that picture and be like, oh, that was the day when I tested the Maybelline eyeliner. Like forever and ever and ever, I'm gonna have this winged liner. Well, I mean, not forever and ever until I take a new passport photo, but you guys know what I mean. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna touch this makeup up and I'll check in with you guys more in a little bit because the day is not done. All right, guys, so we are at FedEx. We are about to take passport photos. I am wearing the crappiest eyeliner of my life, but I'm doing this anyway because I'm about to go on vacation. So question for James, are you going to smile on your passport photo or no? I'm gonna do it two ways. Why is that? because I don't know if we are allowed to I know, smile right? I don't know if you photo. can. My current passport photo, you guys, literally I look like I am having the worst day of my life. I'm scowling, no, I'm angry. you're sexy. You look like <laughs> a Russian spy. Hello. Looks like we got the place to ourselves. Yeah, we're about to close. What's going on? Oh. I can't help you. Um, I think I'm actually- Oh, where's your ring light? Where's my ring light <laughs> for my passport photo? <laughs> you look okay. pretty, baby. What you curious about? What you curious about? We're getting passport photos. It's exciting times. Yes. You guys, it is near bedtime. How do you know that? I'm wearing jewelry and James's t-shirt, which is so comfortable. Why is that? Men's shirts are the most comfy thing to sleep in. Anyway, I am about ready to wash all of this off. I wanted to do a final check-in. I'm sure you guys already know what my thoughts are on this product. For $8.99, it's just not gonna beat out some of my other favorites at the drugstore, oddly enough. One of my favorites is the gel liner from Maybelline, so again, you know, I do love so many Maybelline products, but this one just did not work out for me. I love the way it's shaped, the formula, not so much. I really wish that the formula was better, that it didn't dry down weird, that it didn't skip when I would pull the liner back over the line to darken it up. And then of course, the smudging on the inner corner, which I do have to say after I cleaned it up, it hasn't had that issue since, so that's good. But still, it's just not my favorite and I don't see myself reaching for it again. So this was kind of a dud. But I do hope that you still enjoyed me trying out something new at the drugstore that's kind of weird. Yes, come here. Hi. Hi, look at your little face. Oh, you're gonna come over and say hi too? Oh look, it's the whole family. How's my eyeliner? Ha 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 ha. I think. Ha, ha, ha. Oh yeah, you weren't really in this today, were you? Yeah. Oh wait, you kind of were. What am I thinking? Oh, you know, it looks like eyeliner. Thank you, you've said that twice today. No, but look how crappy it looks over here. You see, it's kind of like chipping off. I can't tell. Hmm. I mean, you, you, you did a nice uh, sort of wing. Is that a wing or a cat eye? I'm done with this. All right, let's go. See you. Oh.